Hey guys, today I will show you how to route your Micromax A87 device. So guys, I have installed one application called Root Checker from App Store. This application tells whether your phone is having root access or not. So let us check. So you can see currently my phone is not having root access. So let us begin. First we need to download and install Java. To download and install Java, go to Google and then type install Java. So from here you can download and install Java. I have already installed it. After this we need to download and install Android SDK. So go to Google and then type download Android SDK. So from here you can download and install the SDK. I have already downloaded it so let us start the installation. Once installation is done, open start menu and type SDK manager. Uncheck all this and go to extra, extras and make sure only Google USB driver is selected, nothing else. So we can see nothing else is selected, only Google USB driver is selected. Now install one package, install. So once it is done, we can close this window. After this, we need to download two files. I have already downloaded these files. Now copy this file adb underscore usb dot ini file. Now open your start menu and then type dot android. Open this folder which will be c C drive user send your username and then dot android. Now paste this file here. After this, you need to install this one which we have downloaded. So I have already installed it. Now we need to connect our phone. After connecting the phone to the PC, go to settings and uh, then go to applications and then go to development and then you should see something called USB debugging check this thing 
now say ok now come back to home screen so we should see a green color android icon coming so guys we can see a green color android icon coming in the notification area here now we need to install unlock root setup i have already installed it now open start menu and type unlock root open it Make sure your phone is connected to the PC and USB debugging is enabled on the phone. Now click on root. Now click on yes. This will restart your phone. Now let us check whether root was successful or not. So I will open the same application again, root checker. Verify root access. So now you can see the device is having root access.